perhaps nothing in French history is as iconic as the guillotine, that steel killer that took down a monarchy. Yet what is less well known is the reasons behind its creation. Interestingly, Joseph Guillotine, who unintentionally gave his name to the device, did not invent it, but he did push for its use. He had originally opposed the death penalty, but since that was not possible, he instead tried to find a more humane method. A guillotine, of course, was far more accurate than a man with an axe, and so this would make the process less painful. Also, a guillotine functions the same for all who are subjected to it, whereas an executioner can be bribed to ensure they did a better job, or do a worse job intentionally if one was not given. It was also far less painful than the traditional hanging or other cruel and unusual punishments given to the poor. Thus, Joseph Guillotine said that all, regardless of class, should be sentenced to death via guillotine. Given this equalizing factor, it is no surprise that it found such extensive use during the French Revolution, becoming known as the National Razor. In fact, the last person to be executed in France in 1977 was via guillotine.